All right. So wait for um, some people to come in. Um, so in this live stream, there's going to be a lot of great information. Why do we, why do many traders fail to succeed? Why are you losing money when you should be making money? So I'm going to be explaining a lot of key facts in this live stream um, from deep, deep experience and, and a system that continuously focuses on adapting. And this is a big, big reason why people fail because their their system or what they're doing to make money is stagnant in thinking. And I will explain this fact in some of the plans. So. Right now, it's early, I just started the live stream and we're waiting for people to come in. And we will wait for people to come in and then we will start the live stream. Yeah, some people are coming in now. Let's take a look here. Hello, 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 Mez. Yeah, it's just started now. I mean, I uh, wait for people to come in. See what I did here. Locations. Yeah, so people are going to be coming in now. And then we'll start this live stream. Yeah, some more people coming in. All right. All right, people, we're going to be starting the live stream. A lot of great information. You know, why, uh, why do traders fail to, to make money? Um, and it's you know it's because most systems fail people so i'm going to be dwelling in that, that what most people think they know they don't know all right people so we're waiting for more people to come in and then i'll be starting and again uh you want to pay attention to this live stream or make sure you listen to it in in, in full uh to get the full power people usually start coming in later um I don't have the time to wait. I mean, I, I, I have a feeling that if I did live streams later, they would, they would be better. Hello, Dexter. Hello. Hello, 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 everybody. J, 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 B, S, so, yeah, this name, hard to pronounce. Uh, you got to put a name, uh, Dexter, hello, Mazia. Yeah. J, B, S, O, Cal, in, oh, hello, Lev, uh, Nathan. Hello, my friend. So I'm going to, we're going to wait a little bit longer um, before we start the live stream. All right, people. So we're waiting. We're getting more and people, more and people coming in. We just started the live stream. We'll give it, we'll give it a few minutes, and then we will start um, as soon as we get at least. A lot of people, though, when I do these live streams, if they don't come to the live streams, they, they see it later. I think it's a start time thing. Me being in, in, in Canada, it's a different time, right? Some people are three hours behind our time, right? I have a feeling that if I did a later one, it would be better, but I don't have the time. So then what happens is people, they do, who, and then if, if people should make time, you know, if you want to come to something that's important, uh, you have to make time in your schedule to that time. All right, so we're going to see 4 a.m. Where, where do you live, uh, Nathan? Where do you live? That's 4 a.m. Israel. Okay, yeah. Israel. Well, there you go. Before a.m. But I see before a.m. You know, now that is someone really serious to be getting up at 4 a.m. to come to a live stream. But I mean, it's doable because waking up early, it's it's like, a, a, you know, as long as you went to bed early enough, uh, uh, Nathan, um, that is the key. Like if you're going to bed, like if you're going to wake up 4 in the morning and you, you, you should be in bed by at least, you know, 10, 10 p.m. Right? You don't want to be, you don't want to sacrifice sleep. I, that, that I can tell you. 
So you can do anything you want in life, but you have to, you have to, it's a give and take, right? If you're going to go to bed too late, how are you going to wake up properly early without getting that rest? But it's good to wake, it's fine to wake up four at 4 a.m., providing you're going to bed early enough, right? All right, so more people are in now. So people, why do people, why do people lose money in the markets, okay? Um, one of the biggest reasons why people lose money in the markets is, first of all, they don't have a, a good plan okay but it's more than that so if your people are relying on indicators let's say people are relying on an indicator method okay now that indicator method might work at one particular point in time in the market but the market's always changing so for example let's talk about you know in december of this year okay well 2018 december the market dynamics were different you know the market was falling due to fear incorrect you know it, it, it things got pushed down for the wrong reasons as you can see how much things rebounded and you have people like who don't understand that they're just negative you know and the negative people who don't adapt they're like baffled like for example the stock companies like baffled the market's going up and they start making excuses why and this is another thing you don't want to be doing making excuses okay now what happened in december was something that's very it doesn't happen very often in the markets, okay? And so if your mindset is still stuck back in December, you're going to fail because you're mentally going to get out of positions because you are used to things not working. And now all they do is work. And so the correct mindset is necessary. So a plan, now, one of my things that I do on my YouTube channel, okay, is I have videos. I want you people to pay attention. I'm going to go to, we're going to go to my YouTube channel because those videos okay what they prove is how consistently how my plans that show targets how they work how it fruitions but it, it it's it's not as simple that just because we make a plan okay we still need to what what it does show is that consistently you can make plans if you can identify things that can move which is what which is another skill that people don't have and hit targets and i show it it's it's so like you can see from from start to end right it's it's very and this is what a lot of people don't show like a lot of these and the reason being is is that even you have a spreadsheet you're saying well, we bought here and we sold but you don't see the movement you don't see the start you don't see the plan you don't see the reasoning you don't see nothing so what my youtube channel shows is it just shows the truth the facts from start to end right from the plan to the confirmation like that triggered and then close that and then so from start to end right so some from start to end and you can see the confirmation in inside of the group right so and then i make the video and this takes time to do right and then there's an intro so it, it takes a lot of time and there's also more passion put into it that's a big difference right it's not just some sort of spreadsheet like every plan that i have and if any plan that I have, there's a passion behind it because we want to make money, okay? And if money was easy, to, easy, was so easy to be made, everybody would be making money. In fact, it's not easy to make money in the market. It's very difficult. It re requires people. Here's the reality. It requires discipline, okay? That's why I tell people to be paying attention to the market on a daily basis. All, even for my followers, right? Hi, hello, Flash. Hi. Even for my followers. Hi, Flash. Hi, it, it's the to become a member inside of power group trades right i teach i teach one powerful thing it's being consistent and i show it by being consistent i prove to my to my members in the group and and having them follow the rules of being of being active i am teaching people how to be um, disciplined so that they can succeed when they're ready okay because mentally the market you gotta understand you cannot think of the market you cannot think of the market as a stagnant thing sometimes you have to make adjustments to the plans for example i want to give an example of amazon okay um, let's talk about this people amazon okay so i'm going to type in amazon here and we were in a plan the 1650 calls okay but you can see we've been we, we, we've been stuck these past two days now 
the calls that we were in the 1650s, we paid, and I have a video that documents this, we paid $1,150 on this day over here, okay? And we held it, right? Because the options went to 2,200, so they practically doubled 100%. And then I mentioned, to, told people to hold runners, and I showed this to the documentation, and we have to, and to use a, the, the proper stop. And of course, it never touched the stop. That's because Amazon favored higher prices. Then, and I told my members that I was looking for $60,000 $6, to $8,000 per, per option. However, the problem was is that it opened up at $4,200 an option. And I looked for where a proper stop would be. And I suggested to everybody $3,500 stop. And they took it out that day. As you can see here, see this low one here? One, six, so what happened was the options went from $4,200 down to about $1,600. And then at the end of the day, they closed around $2,800. So we were still out of it with profits. But this was an adaptive measurement that I had to make, right? And I demonstrated this, right? And of course, Amazon, it's a little bit different with a weekly option than something holding like something like an, a BA. And I want to show the difference, okay? And to show you the difference of adaptive thinking and understanding and how to, how to manage things, this is another skill that no system teaches, right? There's no, they don't factor these. They just, it's not simply because of MACD. Indicators are one thing, but I don't use just, I don't use indicators, first of all, just indicators. They are one tool, but there are more pieces of the puzzle that is required to be successful. It's not as simple as, okay, indicator does this, okay, let's go buy it. Because then there's market, like for example, what happened in December, there are market dynamics, and then therefore it requires some sort of, um, Sometimes you have to give things bigger stops, smaller stops. There's always an adaptive measurement in the market that needs to be given. All right, so and so that's the truth of what happened with Amazon. So let's talk about BA here, okay? Again, people, pay attention to the, the, the live stream of what I'm saying because it's very helpful. A lot of people mentally are not prepared to succeed. And if you don't want to, if you don't take this advice, and then of course in Power Group, there's gonna be some new things I'm gonna be doing, but. I demonstrated this very clearly in power trades that I didn't have to do. And I've been doing this in difficult times to prove a point. Now, let's talk about BA here. Now, BA was something that I posted, okay, uh, right around, was it December the, yeah, here. And basically, it, it, you know, you know, the market, and was this, this was Thursday, so we talked about it. So what happened was I talked about the BA has a good chance to go into the 340, and so on and so forth. So we had the 340 calls, and we got in these on confirmation in the plan. But I talked about BA in the, in the thing. Now, the market back then was still a lot of fear, right? And we had this drop, right? But in BA's case, we had uh, the January 19th 340 calls, which is a lot of times. And a lot of statistical measurement that I got was we were going to get a move, okay? So I already I already had plans of, of uh, where you would where a lot of stocks were saying market will go high, a lot of key stocks. And lo and behold, you know, BA goes up. Now a lot of people, oh, you know, this day you see, like this day was quiet. And, and a lot of times stocks I know require what there was no reason to sell BA. Okay. And then it boom, these two days later, it, it's paying up the dollars, right? It's more than hundred percent gains in the options. Okay. Now trading BA and holding BA and Amazon are two different metrics required uh, of thinking. And again, there was no way to know that Amazon, now Amazon could have clearly went to $1,700 yesterday. It didn't. And therefore it required a, 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 a particular stop for that particular day. You understand what I'm saying? So there's always some sort of an adaptive measurement that is taking place daily. Some, so there's that thinking process. You, you know, it's not simply, okay, this, you use one particular stagnant method and you're going to make all this money. It doesn't work that way. And most people are thinking in a stagnant manner. That is why they cannot succeed. You cannot think stagnantly. Stagnant doesn't work. There, in fact, let me tell you something. I woke up early just to catch this stream. I agree with Sandra. I have to watch market every day to see what's yeah what is moving and what the market is telling us. That's right. So, but at the same time, though, even though I'm telling you all this, it still requires a sophisticated. Um, you need a lot of you need a lot of um. You, it's 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 good to have someone like myself. The difference between me and a lot of and, and I don't think there's anybody out there that's doing it like me. Um, 
is that if you have a big picture leader and you do learn about some technical analysis, technical analysis is not the whole picture. There's way more. I go way beyond that. Like you see these charts, but it's not. It's not only. It's not what I'm looking at only. Like in within my scans, it's a very sophisticated. There are pivot points. I know. I have. I have. It's a very sophisticated thing. I look at a lot of time frames. You know, from three minutes to 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 to, to, to weekly to monthly to there's a it's 120, 195. It depends. What I'm always doing is looking for an answer depending on the time frame and what's going on. And it's so there's a lot of. And I do this very quickly because I have a lot of experience. And there's a lot of people that come into the market. They get. They get the easy period, you know, and then they think they're gonna. It, the market's always easy. Now, another piece of advice I want to give is that you gotta learn to make money in the difficult times and in the good times, because when it's good and you're mentally properly prepared, you kill it. You can make the most money in in. in it's a very short, ten percent to twenty percent of the time is when you make most of the money. Now, listen carefully, people. Ten to 20% of the time is when you make the most money. A lot of people, what happens is they get sucked into that first easy 10, 20% by luck. And then the 80%, they, they, they don't have the patience. Listen to me. If you wanna make it big, you have to grind daily, daily, daily. You have to learn how to go through the difficult times and as well as the good times in order to succeed. Now, on my YouTube channel, Power Target Trades, are so many documented videos and only my channel shows things, plans from start to end in a way with this passion behind it. It's not a, some, some people putting 20, 30, 40 picks with numbers. That's, you don't even believe that they went into it. We went to those. Every plan that I posted was stuff we went into. That's the difference. And it's high quality selection. So I'm, it's not like some people say, what about Netflix? What about NVIDIA? I didn't choose those because they weren't the best performance for this thing. In fact, the ones I chose, most of them did very well. You know, I, I was focusing on Amazon, right? Apple, we were in that, but, you know, um, that's going to need time. There was a bit of a, you know, a, a extra, you know, the market can throw you some unexpected, uh, there are unexpected factors, right? So no system is going to, and that's another thing, you don't need to be perfect. What you want to be doing, another thing I want to make a point, people, is you want to be focused on doing the right things. I, I, I can assure you that this is the only way to make money, by doing the right things consistently. The minute you start making the wrong movements, you sell, like it's better to make money the right way than the wrong way. Believe me when I tell you this. So what do I mean by that? Well, say you sell something, okay, for the wrong reason. And then you watch it go up an extra 100 to 200 percent that's a mistake it's better to l lose the gains the right way because i guarantee you and i can tell you from experience okay um I, i'll give you i mean true story you know i i mentored uh i i was mentoring um a very aggressive individual one of my one of and truth be told i did this documentation where so, so when he followed the rules, right, he would kill it, you know, honestly, like, kill it. But then what happened was, you know, with the market adaptation, all that stuff, we weren't as sophisticated back then, but the rules are the rules. The, the rules and, uh, and following them and the thinking uh, is so important. That's what I can tell you from experience. This is why you're always trying to improve. What, what I do is, I, like, for example, this difficulty that we had in, in, in September, can be a great boost in in massive gains forward thinking 2019 2020 because we have uh i what i do is i encapsulate the 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 difficulty of the markets through 2016 uh, 2008 and i have it all captivated in my system and what i can do now is that it almost becomes i believe that 2018 is a pivotal point now okay so some other good news I have is where is the market? Hello, Eric. So where is the market going? What is the big picture? I can assure you one thing. The market has given, and I have to give more updates, but the market's given signals of a much higher market coming. Okay. So like I said, you know, SPY 3000, this is what I project. Okay. We, we attempt to go to SPY 3000 versus going to, 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 to go to SPY 225. Now, here's a point I want to make, and this will be documented. Uh, SPY 225 was something like an old world thinker where I call the stock clown, right? Where he said it was a pop move. Now, I want to show the difference is that what I see, and this is the biggest, is that there's no way with the, 
with what's going on now and what, what has happened with this pullback, that this market is really set up for 3,000, SPY 3,000 and higher, massive growth, okay? So my system has quantified this already. However, we still need to adapt and take the new information of the market. But what I can say, what the odds, for, and I have to make more updates, but the odds favor that we will go and test closer to 3,000 sometime this year, then go to 225 and we'll be and we'll see what and, and i can say that now and a lot of traders they don't have this ability to make these projections in fact my projections i've hit them over and over again more often than anybody else and that's the kind of trader and advisor that i am okay, the skills that i have it, it totally i'm totally ahead of the game i know i have this confidence and i've proven it like there's people who trade amazon and yet they didn't catch the gains in amazon and when you don't catch the gains in something when when things are given in a, in a very clear manner because you're thinking like two weeks ago you have lost the rate because you're you, if you're missing gains that you should be having for the right reason and you're getting out early because you're thinking about what happened two weeks ago you're losing you lost the key is to catch the gains when the gains are easy then also to avoid, sometimes even avoiding the market, because I like catching good gains. I don't like getting in. I don't like to trade as a mentality or I call baby scalper. When you think small, you always make small money. You never catch big wins, okay? And I, an example, I had a, you know, like I said, someone I met, he would like to go in big, and we and when, when, the, when everything was perfect, I mean, this is a guy, you know, you know going in, you know, turning 30K and turn to, in, into, into 100K in a couple of days. Now, that's the power of my, but this is when things were perfectly aligned, right? And in order to catch those kind of gains with options, yeah, you heard that right. It's very possible. Like, it depends on your thing, right? You have to have the right mind skill. You have to identify the situation. Of course, you don't want to go in that big unless you can afford to. But honestly, he caught these type of gains. Yeah. Hello, Victor. But you understand why people that... So listen, people, anybody who's just coming in, this live stream has a lot of great information about why people don't make money, why you have to adapt, why you have to be... Uh, you, have to st you have to be taking in the information on a daily basis. You can't, you can't trade in a stagnant manner. You've got to be fluid. You have to adapt. Why I can call them? Because my system, I encapsulate a lot of information. Like, but you have to take the negative situations and study them. And so I know 2016. You know, you hear me reference 2016 a lot, right? Where the world record holder, I, I totally, I destroyed him. Destroyed him in terms of analysis skill. Can you imagine? I destroyed him. Because he said... Market would collapse, and I said it was going to rise. And you want to know something, people? I want to show you this here. I'll show you on the monthly chart, and it's documented. I have, I have the documented proof of this. Okay, that's why he can. No one can. No one can run from the truth. Okay, so let me put this over here. That's why I document and I show pain, stake. Like there's emotion. You know, there's a lot of emotion in the truth, right? So here's here here's the um here's the monthly charts. Okay. But 2016 was what we're talking about over here, okay? And, and that's February, uh, well, that's the, I think it's around the February month right over here. Well, it, it, you know, here's the, yeah, I mean, it, it had moved a lot. In, 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 but you see, in 2016, on the reversal, when one trader, world record holder, was calling for him, that's how, you even had Carl Icahn this way. I'm, I'm, listen, 100%, you do, the, you do the research on what was said there, I assure you, that's how negative it was in 2016. But I have a documented, I measured the, the, the success of my call. It, the market has gone up and still up higher, by the way, massively. So stock clowns, all old world thinkers are just far behind in my analysis skills. This is why there's no one out there that will be able, like I can, that's why I can help people with small accounts because we have such a high win rate when when the big look at like i talk about the fedex trade and I, I i everything's passion because the fedex trade was a massive winner and where we made massive gains someone like an old world thinker with no skill like the stock clown lost money shorting because he doesn't know how to adapt and understand what the big picture is and that's another thing big picture thinking 
Small picture thinking, it gives you small gains. And it will deplete you mentally. For little gains. Believe me, I'm telling people, you want to succeed, I got a lot of experience behind it, okay? I've been at this since I've been interested in the market since 18 years of age. Okay. By hand, I would I would I would I wasn't using a computer back then. I had I, I, I got called in and I I was doing commodities because it's easier to do. So I was I would op open high, I would draw in the the chart by hand. Okay. That's the kind of guy you have. Like I have this kind of passion behind the market. I was making money in commodities. Then I started doing the commodities and uh, also trading the you know Japanese yen, British pound because it was fast. You can make and, and you can track you know. And I would just trade what signals. Like I mean, I still made money, but I didn't have the tools I developed back then. Now, but I'm just saying, like, just imagine getting a chart book. I think it was I forgot what it was called. Um, this is the kind of effort I put in and I would look at it and have to write in the volume on myself and it was on paper that's the passion I have right now we have the computer but the way I use this is it's just that passion and then I use it with all this power that's not so technology all I did is it empowered me because when you have somebody that has this kind of passion and learning and studying why 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 you can become get better than anybody else Call myself the big picture leader because I know I'm the big picture leader. The things I do, the things I say is big picture leader. Everybody's pebble, pebble, baby traders compared to scalper. You can be anything you want in life if you believe it and put your mind to it. And I do that and I demonstrate it in my, for anybody to, to get into options so they can buy. We're, we're buying Amazon and we have so many, I have so many documented winning Amazon plays. Tesla, BA, FedEx, real companies, Apple, and massive correct, the big picture. Apple hit 220. I've been talking about 200. We hit way over that. Didn't know it would go to 230, but we adapt and see it, you know. And we got even more gains from the 200 to 230. Option plans and wins, people. Adaptive, it's like new information comes in, you must adapt and then see all the facts, right? That's what people aren't doing. That's why people lose. Because if you're stuck in tw two weeks ago, you're not thinking about this. This is different. This month is going to be different now. This month is different. And so will February. And Fe it could be really good. And then in March, things could be different. It could be very choppy, not, not so great. So if you miss out on the great months to make money because you're stuck back in December, you're going to lose. You see what I'm getting? You lose because then you start, oh, I should have took my profits. And meanwhile, you, didn't ha you, you did nothing wrong. It's just that... If your method is correct, okay, any method can lose money still. So it's the key is to continue doing what's correct. Here's, here's the big takeaway, people. Continue to do what is correct. The money will come. Okay? It's when you fluctuate and do the right and the wrong and the right and the wrong. And the, you you got to be consistent, but you have to be adaptive consistency. That's the big difference. Adaptive consistency. Apple, Apple, uh Apple, I think, is rebuilding. Apple definitely is going to probably go back to 200. How long it takes, I don't know, uh, Big Dog. But I'm already holding the, I have the February uh, calls that are underwater for me. But I believe that I will make money in it. So I'm telling this right now. So I believe that the I have the 170 calls. They're underwater. But they've been gaining some money because they'll put up Apple here. I'll put the daily here. Uh, we'll talk about Apple because I did talk about Apple. So Apple right now is really not my main focus of making the dollar bills, okay? What I've simply done with Apple, people, is you never hear me talk about any new plans in Apple. We had plans that we got, we kind of had this, this fall, but we're regaining itself. So I believe that, at worst case scenario, I believe that the, the bad, whatever bad news they put in, that when earnings come out, the market's already priced everything, that there's a high odds that, you know, Apple could get back to 170, 180, could do 185 sometime in Fe February. It might be doing it even early. So even though I'm losing money, I'm holding my 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 calls, right? And I don't care. I'm just they're there because they already got they already they already they already got killed. So but they can make money, and I'm going to document this too. This is a beautiful thing. What I do is documenting everything that I do and say and thinking. And then when it happens, people then oh wow, because I know what I'm talking about. I you know, I've had hopeless trades turn into winners, big winners. 
for the right reasons. So I believe that Apple's being pushed down way too much, regardless. So high odds that it's gonna go to those numbers. If it doesn't, it does okay. I did the right thing. You know, I you know you're gonna get you're gonna get signals that don't work. But if you long as you keep doing the right things, guess what? We did that with Amazon, we get got paid. Did that with BA, got paid. Right? Same thing with with, with MasterCard. Got paid. So four plans. And Apple still could win. 100 percent correct. Doing what? The right thing. And then of course I had Tesla, another winner, by the way. My win rate's above 80 percent in January because of adaptive thinking and sticking to the rules and understanding what I'm explaining to you. This is why I'm a big picture leader. And I'm also forecasting higher markets. It's a it's a very bright future. Don't listen to the media has no idea what's going on. That's why they tell the news. They tell what they, they see, but they don't see, they don't read the charts. They don't study what I do, right? So they are clueless. I, I, I listen to what the hell some of them talking and they're just clueless people. Clueless. They don't know nothing. Just like in February 11, 2016, they were bearish. And I was bullish and I was right. So It was so bearish. I think it was greater than 95% of the people were bearish, including the world record holder. No skill when it comes to the big picture. Absolutely none. Trader, right? That's it. No big. See, big skills, billionaire mindset. Okay, Billionaire. You cannot be billionaire with a baby mindset. You just can't. And it's not just about money. It's about health. And that's another problem. Right? A lot of people with money, they have no, no skill for their health. And that's what I'm going to change. Health and wealth. Health and wealth. It doesn't matter you have a billion dollars and your health is down the toilet. You can't even achieve your best. There's no, the amount, of, it's not about, uh, just about amount of money, but how do you achieve it? Do you achieve it with, with poor health? Or do you achieve it with, a lot of people with, who are wealthy, they stay, when it comes to their health, they are failing miserably. They are clueless. Steve Jobs was clueless for his health. Clueless. And look where that got him. That end of Steve Jobs could have took. Listen, you, you, we just don't know. But let's say Steve Jobs had his health. That guy could have taken Apple to, to a two trillion dollar company. I, I pretty much believe that. But we'll never know why, because he's not here to to show his true potential, right? Because he was too weak on the health side. You understand, people? The true potential of anybody is succeeding in life. With those both metrics and this is a metric that many fall short you know elon musk could be whatever but you know failing health can mentally it doesn't give you listen to me if you want to be your best you want to have health you want to have a good when you have a healthy mind there you know people like people can go bankrupt but with a healthy mind can go right back to stardom but when you have when you're at the top and your health is deteriorating you can just drop you know what I'm getting, people? So health and wealth is the key. And that's why you hear me talk about it, and I show it, too. You know, I show what I'm doing in my, you know, at my age, right? And again, what I do and how I look at my age is small percentage of the population, small, 5%. Top 5% in the world, and I'll be doing something that is, is, is going to be top 1% in the world I'm working on right now. Top 1% of the world will achieve that kind of greatness Top one percent, top one at the highest level possible, with health to boom. Stay tuned, people. But anyways, that's another story. So adaptive thinking is the key. Any questions, people out there about adaptive thinking? I fell into the two thousand. Oh, you did, Dennis. I fell into the two thousand. What do you What do you mean by that? That's a good. That's a good thing to explain, Dennis. Uh, Goose is cooked if he can't turn things around. Yeah, I, I wouldn't worry about that. Um, you know, uh, let me tell you something about Apple. Uh, let me tell you guys something about Apple. Um, they have, the problem with Apple is they can turn, they have the money to turn themselves around, okay? But their technology is ahead of everybody else. They, they, they have, they're able to produce their own chips. They actually invested in this. The iPhone is the fastest phone on the market. Even though it may, may, may be more underpowered, you, you, you go see, the iPhone is the fastest phone. Samsung cannot beat it. No phone can beat the iPhone in speed and, it's, and, and how fluid and fast it is. Go do your research. Okay. And the reason why, good advice, I'm guilty not letting them run. Yeah, well, 
that's okay. That's why you have the big picture expert to help. Too high, so I short. Oh, you mean what? What, what do you mean, uh, Dennis? You thought it was too high in this in 2016? 2016, the market was down a lot. I don't understand what you mean by that. It was too high. You thought it was too high. How? Um, I don't understand. You thought it was too high in 2016? Oh no no. Oh, you mean oh okay. That different. You're talking about a different time. Anyways, Dennis, it, you know, the key is this. If you can learn, right, from your experience. Listen carefully, people. <clears throat> so I, I gotta, if you can learn from your experience and listen to what I'm saying in these live streams. Like, I'm really telling you with heart here, passion, really, how I really feel about uh, you know, what I'm saying. Like, my YouTube channel is totally unique. And I have to explain this more. You know, but I, I wasted too much time trying to show how someone like a stock clown is just wrong and I, I proved it and it's just a waste of time you know what let people figure that out themselves you know uh, the stock clown is a clown and you know always he won't change um but what i can do is help people see their problem every a lot like, like people like the stock clown are very damaging to people I, that's why i wanted to expose them that way but you know what i can't help i can't can't waste my energy on these things People like the stock clown really damage people because they they have no clue what they're talking about, right? Um, people following someone like a stock clown, they they might be right on a short period of time, but then they're wrong. Like, look at from 2016, the stock clown was bearish the market, and he missed out on so many positive gains that had he just been going long and and, and adapted, had more of adaptive thinking. Uh, which he doesn't. It's, you, you cannot change your person. If you are thinking the wrong way, you're going to lose the big picture. Then when he finally gets right, he's all happy, making like he made. He was quiet all through 2018, right? As soon as the market started going his way, and again, for luck, because he had no no idea, right? By luck, simply by luck. Some people get lucky, guys. But then, as the market's going up, he's complaining back the same. Grandma, grandma, you know, complaining, oh, making excuses. That's not how you make money in the market. You don't tell what them. So my point is you want to always adapt and no system is right all the time. And that's okay. But what you want to do is stick to rules that work. And my rules work more often than not at a high, at a high rate. Even though I wasn't doing very well in December, I stuck to my rules to make the big return in this January. You see, you always win in the big picture. And I'll prove this over and over and over again in these videos, even from losing positions. You know, two times I got into BA, they were losing positions only to turn in winning positions because, listen carefully people, the big picture was correct. And I understood that. And though, so I made um, adjustments. This is why my system is not stagnant, it's fluid to help counterbalance the 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 sometimes sometimes things that are you know shocking things like the market can throw at you but you need to adapt and realize that that's that we can still make that comeback and they did like i, I put up ba here and i and i show you the story now i didn't follow my rules at the same but there was a signal we took it a little bit too early but this is honest this is a true story so we went in here and we bought the 350 calls okay and then pulled back right but we held the position i especially when we reversed the state and you got to look at this so we were as low as 296 but because i was right the big picture we went from 296 to a high of 369 in a matter of um one two three four five six six seven eight days now so those calls ended up as they were against me about 80 percent Okay, and I had this this time I, doing adaptive thinking and reasoning and all the factors I was looking at. I held the position to turn it to a hundred percent gain. I was happy even to break even at this point in time, but the market gave us new signals, especially here. And I knew that there, I was up. I was very optimistic of of of, of um, you know making some gains, but we made even better than that, hitting a hundred percent gains. Even from up the pullback point where I had where I got stopped out, and then we entered some other plan, another plan, and it went against temporarily, only to go four. Again, why? 
big picture and using a strategy and adaptive thinking allowed me to make the money even though sometimes you can lose temporarily but if you correct the big picture with a strong strategy and understanding of, of what's going on in the market then you can prosper but when you start wavering and getting out when you're not supposed to get in you start and you're not you're not focused you will be like crying many people are crying like well, i just missed out huh? so many gains uh, uh. we always what one of our rules is when we're when you're up a lot take take half off and then hold runners and now sometimes the runners actually they don't make anything for you that's okay as long as you do the right thing you can catch those big gains and when you miss those big gains you you you, you listen like they're like that when you miss your big gains it's 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 harmful because the market doesn't always give you spectacular gains every month of the year. There are those months that are key. And if you're not mentally ready for it and focused to do the right things, you won't catch it. Believe me. That's what a lot of people do. They miss it. Because they're focused on the little scalping that they can't catch those monster. You know, a couple of monster gainers, they just put so much money in your account that you can go make 20 little, 20 things that don't work out. And that is not the case. It's very that doesn't even happen for us. But for example, and a couple of my winners are so powerful that they wipe out all those losses in the twenty and put you in super gains. That's I'm telling you, and it it happens all the time, especially if you were studying my channel on a daily basis and you're going through the plans and you're you're doing the work daily, right? It's work. Nothing's for nothing in this world. The market isn't going to hand over the dollars to you for nothing. You've got to put the time and the effort. Anybody, anything to succeed in life requires that heart, that passion. If you go things that things things like you know, like a joke, you know, like it's all oh, this is some side money. The side money is what you're gonna make, right? You want to make. Everybody wants to make the quick dollar, but they don't want to put the work and the time to succeed. And that's why I prove that if you do that. Or if, especially if you're following me and my advice and my strategies in the group or have even someone help you in this right and understand what I'm saying you can grow in leaps and bounds yeah I wouldn't worry about that there are things that you know these are the people that just say things you know but trust me there the, the US is um, it's set up right now. I have some strong signals that that are correct more often than not. Like nothing's 100%. And right now, I believe the market is setting up. Um, is going to go what I said. We're going to go and test 3,000 sometime this year. And of course, it can go a lot higher than that, right? Amazon, for example, is a stock that has the potential to go to $2,500. All right, so... It's a stock to pay attention to. All right, now. I mean, it's why I'm making a lot of plans on Amazon. Amazon's already signaled that it has a lot of potential. Well, Apple, I think it's needing time, but I definitely see Apple going back to 200, and then and then from there we'll see. But to 200 at least, right? Um, it's like, you know, all companies have to make comebacks, you know? The fact of the matter is Apple makes the best smartphones on the market, okay? They're, it's the, Listen, people. They, they have an advantage of everybody. They, they make the hardware and the software. See, Google makes an operating system and, and all these phones. And I have, I have, I, I can tell you that the, 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 the Google phone, anything, any Android is, does not compare in speed towards, and they, and they never will win. You go do that. You see the test. They don't, they don't, Apple has a more, it runs faster. It's more stable. It runs faster. You can't compare. You just can't compare, and the reason being is they they, they have they, they they even they even own they, they make their own hardware and they and they're ahead of the game. They, their chips are faster than than Qualcomm chips. Even if they have more power, Apple can 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 build the 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 the, 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 the phones that have less. Uh, they may have less speed, but they're more efficient, and so they use the they and because the software is optimized to their hardware, it just runs better. Right? Google doesn't have optimization for the hardware, right? Because they have to run on so many different phones. This is why Apple has an advantage in speed. They are really a hardware and software company. They have these two combinations. The problem is, is that 
they're also scrutinized and you know anyways to me when it comes to the phone uh, it, there's no one faster than an iPhone well we'll take it from there like I'm I I, I highly doubt it like it's you have a company that I mean all they got to do is hire somebody that has some innovative ideas they, they can buy that stuff you know they have a lot of money Apple right so they have a lot of advantages that a lot of companies don't have they have success they have a product that's superior they have they're able to make faster phone they're, you know what here's another thing they might start making you know instead of using Intel chips for the Mac they they might make their own computer chips soon they have the power to do everything for themselves. They're getting more powerful in the hardware. And they're also a software company, right? So they have this advantage over making the fastest phones. Like that's why they're the fastest. They're the fastest phones. Go go do the research. The fastest, but that's despite the point. Like I don't we're not gonna I don't gonna put all my I mean Apple is a winner for me no matter what. I have Apple as a long-term investment. I make thing. It's not my only thing. I mean, we're going to trade money, but I'm saying it has the potential, I'm saying, okay? That's a big picture. Yeah, it, it don't matter. Um, I think the Qualcomm thing is dumb. Is dumb. Uh, Apple makes their own chips. Uh, Apple has their own. I, I, I don't really care about that stuff, uh, there because I, I really focus on the big picture on the majority. That Apple is one company, and Apple has the money to, 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 to succeed. You know, it's just simply investing the right way, and they get that right. Every every company is listen. Microsoft had to make a comeback, and so can Apple, right? And but they have products people love. Like they're, they're simply the iPhone is simply is the best phone out there, you know. But anyways, that's another. You know, let's not talk about Apple anymore. I believe Apple will will make a comeback to two hundred um, sometime this year. Could be faster. I, it's not my main focus right now. I am holding the February calls, and I and I'm a long-term holder in Apple. What I'm focusing more is on Amazon, the other other key companies. Okay, Amazon more important right now. I think Amazon is a new key stock. It's 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 one of the it's it, it, and it's great to trade in the options now. I mean, and there's some powerful signals that I like. It's in my that fall, it's following my rules. This is why I really like Amazon. So right, people. Um. So any new people, listen carefully. You want to study my created playlist on uh, power target trades because there's a lot of proof there. Like I said, I put a lot of passion. The videos show what a lot of people don't do. The people show you spreadsheets. There's no passion. There's no. There's no. This is no. It's the worst thing to see. My videos show the plan. You see the plan, and you see the, the ideas and the options we're using, and then the confirmation, and then the end result. All plans have a vision. They have a target, and, and 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 a lot of times we hit targets or we even exceed them, and that means the big picture was massively correct, and that's what a lot of traders fail to do. Like these little day traders, you know, they they little penny try, they, they go for a little pop, pop, they got no skill because they can only see ten minutes. They're only looking for those ten minutes, and then they're out for them. And meanwhile, I've seen some 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 of the ideas they go huge, but they don't know how to catch that. I'm focusing on that, you know. The richest people, they want to catch the real moves. They don't want to catch baby moves. Baby moves are for baby baby gains. And it's more stressful to catch a lot of baby gains than a couple of big gains. Think about this carefully. Less stress. Less stressful. Health is more important than anything else, right? Good money. You don't want to, you don't want to be making money and being stressed out. You want to be calm, make smart decisions with skill. That is what I am trying to teach. And preach and prove without a doubt uh, so so again BA we I most of the time I get into the stock I lose temporarily only to win it's it's like if I have 10 plans in BA I'm, I'm winning like nine nine out of ten times that's the kind of success I have so and I have a lot of documented videos in BA in fact um, if we go to my YouTube channel, I'm going to show you this. Uh, I'm sorry, my Twitter channel. Uh, I got to show you this, guys. Let me just go to this over here. Um, we're going to go to the. I want to show you this. So I'm going to show you the difference. This is what I do, and I and I posted this proof on on Power Trigger Trade, right? So we're going to go down here, and we're going to show what I said here. I want to. I want to. This is really important. I want to show this. So here you see me. Like I honestly, like I I I I, I put a lot of passion in, into what I do. 
uh, where is it here? Uh, December, here it is, B8. See December the 30th? So here's the B8 plan. So let's take a look at this, okay? Let's take a look at this here. Let me let it come, come off, come off, oh, come on. Okay, why is it doing that? Maybe I, okay, there it is, okay. So let's look at this. Now I want you to look, I'm going to read this, okay, people? BA is set up to test 360 to 370. You see that? I have direction. The January 18, 340 calls are great to use. You see that, right? So BA needs to, I will explain inside. Of, so what I said to people is we're, and we confirm, by the way, inside of Power Group Trades. But now look at what I show. I, 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 I label and I go, I show the options. You see the options were 360. Now, today they hit a high, by the way. They hit a high of $1,200 an option a few weeks later and through the chop and through worry because the big picture was the stock gave the proper signals and then we also had spy confirmation too. That's another thing that made me want to hold even more. And and I and I even explained a story here. I have, so you see the passion I put into this plan. It's not that I just give up idea and there's no heart. There's heart here. Look what I, you know, read, like, read it. You can read it, right? And I had people telling me I was crazy that BA, when I was telling people to go long, when it was $200. And look where it is to this day. And I mean people, they were, there were so, people with so-called technical analysis skill, really high level, massively wrong. Believe me, anybody that goes against me, they get crucified. The people who work with me or or, or kind of agreeing with me, different story. But I'm talking about the ones who go against me, my words, crucified. Case in, case in matter, uh, uh, world record holder against me, crucified. Uh, stock clown against me, crucified. Right? Just destroyed, annihilated. That's it. Um, because... They don't see the big picture like I do. Right? I, mean, I prove this and I have it all documented. So to my horn, it's, it's the facts, it's the truth. Right? So, uh, you know, you can see the passion written and I demonstrate this. I mean, it was, it's not like a confirmation. And look where it is. I mean, you know, now BA still has in fruition the plan. We are still holding the plan. If all goes well, right? We're still holding. We also took off some, some, some gains today, right? Greater than 100% gains. You, should, you, should, you take profits and hold runners. We, we, we can't lose. <laughs> and all in fear. And all because I stuck to the plans. And I adapt. You understand? And this is why we are the best. The best. Billionaire mindset. Billionaire as an ex is to, to, to signifies, so you don't have to be a billionaire, but I'm saying billionaire signifies mindset, confidence. You can't become the best in fear, and you can't become the best without confidence and a love in yourself. Right? See, power trick or trade, you can see. I have love for myself, you know what I mean? I have respect for myself. I have pride in myself. I take care of myself. See, a lot of people, you know, they say, you know, men, the men, the men, they get married, they let their... See, you shouldn't be looking good or, or having a good health just because to attract a woman in your life. That's not the only reason you should be... And this is what I, I understood this a long time ago. Again, a lot of men don't have the successful mindset. I did it for myself. I understand about you want to be healthy and strong for yourself, not for anyone else, for you. You look at yourself and you say, hey, man, I like this guy. When you look at yourself and you're saying, oh, I don't like me. Oh, I'm too fat. Oh, I'm too this, I'm too that. When a person starts thinking negative, how do you succeed in life when you're negative, when you don't even love yourself? When you look at yourself and you say, man, I, I'm, I'm, I'm fat. Oh, I got a big belly, which a lot of guys do, by the way. Fat, fat, fat souls. You got a little bit of a gut. We got skinny fat, you know. Skinny arms, little belly. Yeah? Tons of men walking around like that. I know this is a fact. Statistical fact, it's high. 80% men are like this, skinny fat. Little arms, skinny legs, or weak, little pooch. If you got a little pooch, any little stomach you got is already a sign of decline. It's not healthy. That's another story. But you see my point, people. Without the right mindset, strategies, how do you succeed? You can't. 
You always, that's why people fail. And you're looking for, oh, maybe I'm going to get this indicator. That, no, no indicator. Some indicators are going to work for that one month of the year, for that short term, and then they're out to lunch. Or they miss out, or you miss out a lot of gains because your, your method doesn't catch the big picture. Big picture mindset. Like if you want to be a little scalper, then you must trade like a little scalper. You cannot do what we do. Because a little mind, if, you're, if you're scalping for gains, right, you won't catch the big gains. You won't be prepared mentally to catch them. You see what I'm getting at, people? So health, create strong mind, wealth. Wealth can be achieved even with your, without your help, but the problem is your mental capacity declines when your health, and when, especially when your confidence is low. You know, believe me, you know, Steve Jobs wasn't at his best at, at, at the later thing. He made good, but he wasn't at his best, believe me. You don't know. See, super health and a strong mindset of, and, and, and continuously doing good work, People never saw him at his best. Believe me, what I'm telling you, he's, I use him as an example because he's well known, was very successful, but probably could be three times, four times more successful with the mindset of power trick or trade. Okay, way more successful. Okay? I believe that if you're dying, if you're if you if you're out, if you if you leave this world due to poor health issues that were total avoidable, you're you're a big L. You lost. You couldn't be your best. And you lost when you had all that money and you couldn't get yourself to be the best. That's L, loser, loser, L. Like a stock clown, gonna be finished. But trust me, 50, 55, down, poor health, guarantee. I already project that unless he changes and repents and realizes he's wrong and maybe wakes up and says, you know what, that Sandro was right all along. What a dummy I was not listening to that guy. It's too late for him when you're some well it depends some people they never mentally they, they, they even they may he might realize but he goes ah i'm too old now i'm sick i'm just gonna just die <laughs> anyways people <laughs> yeah that's what you got to be to succeed you got to be believe in who you are i am the big picture leader uh i the way i think is 100 percent correct real success comes from both health and wealth it doesn't come from one or the other it's a combination, real success. Now, why do I say that? Well, theoretically, I can give you an example. There's a barber, right? And the guy, you know, he's able to, you know, at 107 years old, oldest barber, okay? Okay, it's barber, but the oldest barber, 107 years old. 107. Now, he doesn't, he looks old, but I'm saying he's capable to move and walk and cut hair. So what that proves is that, let's say he's the best at being that barber, okay? But he's able to do that in 100 plus years so if you're 50 years old and you have a lot of experience and but you're good with your health what can you achieve with all the experience of making mistakes between 50 to 60 to 70 see most people very successful people um they get even more successful as they get older because there's a lot of experience is behind it right so me power trick or trade when i'm older who knows what I'm going to do? Like, because my mindset and my and my level of thinking will be even higher than it is now. Where most people are on the decline because their health is declining. Okay? So 50-year-old, young man still, if you're thinking the way I think, people think you're old. No, you're not. You're old because your, your society's methods keep you, make you old. And you, then you think you're old. And as soon as you're thinking negative, you go down the tubes. Like, you don't hear people explain things like that to you. I do. Health and wealth. I explain things in a metrical way that makes you think. And I study these facts. And I think like this. How do we become our best? We need both. And, and you've got to get... So, even if you're not making the most money, if you're making... If you can't have control of your health and you're, you have great experience and a greater mindset and, and you're able to manage your time better and better and with more wisdom... You're going to do better as you get older with more skill okay like steve jobs started doing a lot of some bigger things in his older age not in his younger age his older from his experience and then finally it's like and it, his time came and then he came up with that iphone right and he realized that you need to make an, a different operating system 
Now, Microsoft never thought about that. They thought to stick with the old. He's realized, you know what? We need to, we need to redesign the operating system for this device, mobile device. And that was the game changer that no one was doing, people. But to see, he understood that from experience. Right? Yeah, he, was understood, he, 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 he understood function. Even though he didn't have the, 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 the you know, like, like, like maybe the programming skills of Bill Gates or whatever, but, but he had more understanding of, and he made, again, a better judgment call, you know, that took Apple to a high pinnacle level. Now that it came down to it, as the right guidance was put forward, he, 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 he drove the company, and even when he was gone, to its pinnacle high state first, you know. The right leadership, the right mentality always wins over every other method out there. But one of the metrics that it's missing out there, that's missing by a lot, is the health component. Okay, And you're only as good as your health. Remember this. If your health increase, increases with your age, you have great health, your abilities always increase. So Steve Jobs, believe me when I tell you, his potential was never reached. I believe it could be a $2 trillion company. If if there was his by now by with under his leadership but anyways people that's despite the point i just want to give you the the, 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 the differentiation here of the combination of health and wealth uh, how po so the same thing for a trader if you want to be your best you don't have to be you've got to have both metrics and you want to learn and you want to grow and you want to be adaptive and fluid that makes sense people Time's it. Holy man, 10 on 1. That makes sense? I want to cut this to, I think this is a very powerful and influential um, live stream. Any, any, Anybody have any quick questions? So it makes sense. Good. I'm glad you understand that, uh, GB. Martins, yeah. Look, the smart people will get it. You know, the people who want to, good night, good night, mess, good night, good night. The wrong people won't, won't, won't succeed. You know what I mean? It, my live streams are here to tell you the truth, right? Like why, it's like what I'm doing is very unique. It's very different. Uh, and it's the way, the only way to go. Uh, you you, you want to make money for the right reasons. And believe me, it will always make you succeed in the big picture of things. And I prove that in my videos. All my plans are detailed and straight. They're, 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 there's passion behind it. I want to make money. Nobody wants to lose money, but you know what? Loss is part of this too. Like it's, you have to accept that. But if you lose for the right reasons, it's okay. It's when you lose for the wrong reasons or you, you miss gains for the wrong reasons or that's when you get killed. And that's what a lot of people don't get because they're not fluid. Their method is stagnant. Mine is not. It's adaptive. Every day the market gives you a new piece of information. Therefore, you need to quantify the information with what you're seeing. What, what adjustments do I have to make? Should I be doing this? And... That's a new piece of every day is a new piece of information from the past to the present, which is the day. Tomorrow, new piece of information comes, how we act, how we open, how we, we close. New information came in to the picture. Adapt the rules, changes, should I get out of this or should I not keep holding, and so on and so forth. Should I be paying support? Should I be getting out because we hit the targets? Because of this, so this should we hold long? Should we hold for the higher targets? All this is quantified by adaptive thinking based on market input coming in. And at most systems, if you're thinking on a stagnant level, without that extra input, you're going to fail. You won't catch the big. You'll be a pebble, pebble trader and burn out for nothing. You're making little dollar bills for the wrong reasons, and you will burn out. Believe me. So if you make, I'll give you an example. You make ten thousand dollars. And then you make a lot of stupid ideas because you, you got lucky on that 10,000. You can lose all that 10,000 and go 10,000 in the hole. But the guy with the right skill maybe goes up 10,000, loses 5K, and then makes 20K because he followed the right method consistently and adapted correctly. You see the difference? This, I guarantee you, works the way I just said. So imagine you go from 5, uh, you go to 10K, you lose 5, doing all the right things, and then you go to, because you do all the right things, you're, you're going to 20 now. So now you're up 20 plus, you're up 25. The other guy, he's at, he's, he's, he's minus 10 because he's doing the wrong things and doesn't make money the right way. He finally, they go to zero and they get frustrated and they start trying this and that. They make some money, then they lose. They go, they go mentally, their health goes on the tubes 
They're not a statistic. Gone. 90% fail the market. My way, health, improving, improving mindset. You, this is top one, top, you know, five, ten percent. Now, me, you have a chance with me, with my guidance and my leadership and my motivation. I can help you be your best because you have a guy. They say, you know what? Well, Sandro is he's my, you know, he's, he's sometimes I could be older than the person. Man, this guy's he's, he's, he's kicking my butt, man. I, I gotta shape up. Therefore, leader. You have to be the best as a leader. The best. In both examples, right? Oh, well, power trick or trade does that, right? Oh, I, I'm, I got this going, Sandra. I have a power trick or trade, family man, you know? I power trick or trade, I, I have everything. I, 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 nobody has my metrics. I have the experience. Family, wife, kids, making money in the market, losing money in the market, health. Studying that, improving on that, being consistent year after year after year. You can see, you know, I have a video, I have pictures of me in 2012. And in 2018, with the right mindset and thinking and always adaptive thinking, just annihilated myself in terms of, I was never, I was, just you can see this huge difference in my waistline. Both waists were good, but the, the improvements in, in, mus in, in the muscle mass on the top to the waist what, what, what was massive and that they did this older by the way and that's my point this is what why i'm the best people aren't doing that it's very few percentage one two percent in the world did what will do what i do have the mindset and the stability to do what i'm doing this is why i am the leader pick picture leader understand people netflix i'm not focusing on right now however they're saying my focuses have been on different stocks uh, tesla uh, ba uh, amazon um, Netflix, again, it's not like it won't do well, but I haven't been focusing on it. Is that they didn't meet my criteria. Even though it did well, Amazon did better. There was more money to be made in Amazon, okay, uh, Har Har Harvinder Singh. Yeah, I, I, I'm just not focusing on, it's not like it's not good. Don't get me wrong, Har Harvinder, but my method doesn't work this way. It works on the higher probability and then I focus on those. I don't, if I make a plan or a recommendation, I want to be going into that plan, right? That's how I do things. Um, so, I mean, uh, I'll put up Netflix. You asked me the question here. Um, it, it's a good question. So let's put up Netflix here. Um, yeah, Netflix made a, yeah, ne well, the thing about this, Netflix made its moves you know, thing. It, it did pretty good, you know, um, Again, I'm not always going to catch everything, but but I wanted to get like there's sometimes there's a lot of good things happening. That's what I my metrics show, anyways. But my focus was not on Netflix. If you did focus on Netflix, I can assure you the one thing, as I did track it a bit um, in terms of um, that if you had traded Amazon, you had made more money uh, trading Amazon than Netflix options uh, with under my thing. So I would rather be in less positions with quality. And that gives you less stress, so you hold things properly. When you're in too many positions, sometimes you get, you know, you know, as much as this did fluctuate. So, anyways, it's it's good Netflix, but I haven't been focusing on it. So, right now, I'm still not focusing on on Netflix because I believe Amazon is just a a, a more important stock to pay attention to. Uh, that's the reality, um, and then. I have a plan already for that. Uh, uh, how to how to deal with Amazon? I already have a plan in place. Uh, it's a, it's a little unique case based on adaptive thinking of what's going on in the market and probability and facts factors and the big picture of Amazon. Amazon is a big strong focus for me for a long time it, it, uh, because I believe the potential for Amazon is twenty five hundred dollars long term. Twenty five hundred dollars. You're going to see some shocking information happen. And again, it will be documented on the stream. Of course, we will adapt. Don't forget that we have to adapt. If something doesn't look right or acts wrong, we're not going to fight the market. Remember, that's another thing. You never hear me fight the market, but we don't. If we get the right, if as long as the market gives us the right structure and the right reasons, we continue to hold those plans. We don't fight the market like a stock clown who fought the market for years and missed out on massive gains and made pebble gains. And that's what I'm trying to teach you, people. Do you see spy green tomorrow or red futures are bleeding i haven't seen the update on the thing you know the, the market can change in the morning um you know we can start negative and go positive the market can be can also become can be very uh what's the word um 
that can fluctuate. So we'll see what it does tomorrow. It doesn't have to be. It can be start red. Uh, an answer is it can start red and go green. Oh, this guy. Oh, it's a short. Yeah, Frank Joseph. This guy here, man, you know, that's not even your real name, man. That's another, it's an account you, uh, uh, this guy here is, uh, I, I know his, uh, his picture, Frank. It's a, it's a short, yeah. It's a short, yeah, you, 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 you short, uh, you, you, you short, uh, um, you, you're, you're thinking like a pebble trader, this guy. We make good, great gains in, uh, in Amazon. Where are your plans, uh, Frank Joseph? Which is not even your real name, by the way. I know who you are. I know exactly who you are. But anyways, I don't want to get into it. Like I'm not even here to, to fight with, with, with clowns. You know, I'm here to, to help people. I'm here to ex explain to people who want to learn. Uh, I'm the big picture expert. I have documented videos. Uh, most of these people who make these clownish remarks uh, don't have any skill and don't have any, and they can't do what I do. They have no way of doing what I can do. In fact, they, they, they're just they just react to what the day if, if you know anyways i don't want to get into it. it just it's a waste of time my point is people i've proven myself through my youtube channel they don't right anybody that makes a complaint ask them show me what you've done with your life show me what you've done they they, they can't they can't reproduce what they can't even show what i do on my youtube channel it's so full of documented proof i put a lot of work and passion into what i do every plan Right? But like I said, nothing's gonna be for nothing works hundred percent. But we want to make money for the right reasons. In my opinion, Amazon is very structured to go much higher. There's signals now. When I'm right and you see that Amazon is much higher, you're gonna look like a clown. And I guarantee you that Amazon favors higher prices over lower right now until something changes. It favors higher prices. There's gonna be fluctuations, but Amazon, boom, can go a hundred, two hundred points in days. Look, you don't, listen, I know what I'm talking about in days. It has one day that fluctuates 50, 40, and then it just, she jumps. If the direction is up, you're going to miss that because you were looking for the wrong short idea. And that's, that's, I'm not that type of trader. I'm trying to catch the big picture. That's why we caught these big gains in Amazon. Two winning plans in Amazon. Two strong winning plans in Amazon. Look at Amazon, how much, it's, look, look, look how much has moved, okay, since, since December. Right. Here's the low. One three oh seven, and here's 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 the thing. If you didn't go long and you didn't make money in this, you have no skill. If you were shorting this, why? You 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 you're going to you're going to lose in the big picture of things because you don't your your method will won't work for the big picture. You might get lucky. Luck runs out. Trust me when I tell you. Luck runs out. People, I'm telling you this from experience. Skill never runs out, but luck does. People get lucky and then that's why they lose money and they 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 get in ruts. Poor low low ruts, right? Like I said, any clown that comes and says I says Let, let's see your health let's see you let's see you show yourself like the stock clown he won't show himself but i guarantee you he will look like a fatso with a it'll be skinny with a with a with a with a with a, with a, with a pop belly guaranteed judging by how i hear him speak and he won't show himself right a lot of these traders they won't show they won't show you show yourself alpha male here right? I, I'm, gonna delete, I'm gonna delete anybody out there that wants to go against the truth the facts because I put passion in what I say. I don't lie. Like I tell the truth the way it is. Okay? And I document. I put the time and effort and work. And I do these live streams and I explain these things. Right? And everything matters. The name, my name, the power trick or trade, the, the, the background, the symbol, the, all these things I put in. I put effort and work into all this stuff and thought into that and refinement. And some of these things were developed because of because of uh, uh, followers of mine wanting me to, to do something. To, to, and it, one it was a guy named Fernando gave me this idea, but I then I just I, I then fic, I then uh, I I I look to improve it, uh, the the logo, right, and I put a lot of effort and time in because it represents something to me, right. The logo, everything I do, there's a, there's an effort it represents to, to me. You know what I mean? Like I, I care, right. It's not about the daily movements. They, the little movements 
don't matter. Listen, we were being, we, we, you know, you can be right and be wrong temporarily, but if you write the big picture, the gains will always come to you. Guaranteed, people. I know what I'm talking about. And that's what I demonstrate in my live streams. I explain it. I prove it. I've said it millions of times. Uh, I talked about Apple, the spy, and all my metrics were the ones that happened in 2018. We were closer to 3,000 to 3, than before that, you know, before the, some political issues, right? Because the U.S., they got to solve something, okay? And you notice why the market went up a lot, people. Keep this in mind. We went up because of the jobs reports. Because I've been always saying the companies are really strong. I said this before. When all that negativity and fear, I said, listen, people. Like, like Trump was saying, though, the that Wall Street didn't know what they're talking about, you know. Power trucker trade was on the right page. I was the one talking about how the market's bullish, how this downturn is bull is, is, is due to the wrong for the wrong reasons. This is why we had this massive reversal. Okay, nobody was talking like this. I'm the correct big picture winner again, crushing. The, I'm not pebble trader thinking. I am the billionaire mind thinks. Think, think, right? This is what billionaire. They want to see people visionary like this, calling calling the shots like this. They don't want a little pebble trader, ten minute trader. No, no. They want to see Amazon. I had plans, and Amazon went higher, and we hit it up two times. Three hundred percent gains on the 1650 calls. You see where we are now? One six five nine. It's in the money by nine dollars in a chop for two days. That's how massively correct I was. The big picture. And Amazon higher prices is is in due. You know, any pullbacks that come in, there are opportunities. All right, people, let's have a good night here. Uh, I hope you learned something because I'm talking with passion, okay, and telling the truth. Power trade out.